Hey guys, it's watching you and Natalie. My name is AJ, and we are back on another episode of Let's Build a City, episode 20, the big 2 0. I was going to do a bit of a server tour, but you've seen most of the world. Most of you have seen most of the world. Maybe I'll do one sooner, like 25 or something like that, and we'll go around and see what we've done so far. But last episode, we built this skyscraper, and a lot of you were saying, Build a construction zone, build something in the making. And I thought, yeah, that's a cool idea. We're a developing city. We should have uh, we should have some construction sites about. So I've got the uh, the fences up and the gates on the front here to get in. I've got a couple of um, material, what do you call them, hills, where they're being pushed by the diggers. We'll build some digs and stuff like that. But I think the first thing we need to start off with is what the actual building is. We're going to build a bit of a skyscraper, but it's going to be actually unbuilt. So we're going to start at the bottom here, and we're going to have a, where are we, about here, maybe one, two, three, four, and then we're going to go out five blocks, one, two, three, four, five, like this, and then just have one, and then we'll go out another five blocks, one, two, three, four, five, another one, and then one, two, three, four, five, what about like that? Now, to me, that's not quite wide enough, so we're going to go out one more. Uh, three, four, five. We're going to go out to there. And that's going to be how wide the skyscraper would be. And then we'll go along here and we'll make a square of this. So three, four, five. One there. One there. And one there. Yeah, one, two, three, yeah. And then the big corner ones. And then these pillars are going to go straight up. This is sort of the uh, structure of the skyscraper. Let's see if I can just do it for my eye. That's about right. And that's about right. And there. Beautiful. And then one more. And then I can explain what we're really doing. Because uh, you might, you guys might be thinking, well, this looks disgusting. I took all the grass out because, obviously, you don't have grass on a construction site, do you? That's going to look awful, isn't it? But what we're going to do here is we're actually going to shoot up. Let's get some speed potions. We're going to shoot up and make these into really high pillars. Pretty much as high as where the uh, skyscraper is going to be built to. Um... Maybe maybe up to there, I think, for render distance-wise, because we're going to build a crane that's going to be building this as well. So we're going to do this. And these are the big concrete pillars, so I'm using the same material, the same block as what we're using for the road, as that sort of concrete as well. So it's going to, it's going to blend in nicely, I think. We'll go down here. What I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to cut away while I do these big pillars, and I shall be right back. Right then, it's skidding night time, and I want to apologise, I just looked at like the timer of that recording of that first clip, and it was like two minutes long or something, like world's shortest intro before having to cut away ever. Uh, I apologise for the darkness, I just thought I'd come back for a couple of reasons. One, I've put the uh, pillars all the way up now, so we've got the concrete pillars, and now I'm just dividing up where each floor will be, and eventually I will fill these in, but I'm not looking forward to it, because that's an awful lot of blocks to fill in, and I hate filling in huge amounts of space. But I thought I'd come back as we would have a chat. Um, a lot of you know that my, if you watched Minecadia back when we were uh, doing Minecadia, um, my Xbox One pad broke and I sent it away. And then the Xbox One Connect broke. So I had to send that away. Well, it's been a good 27 days or something like that since uh, I sent them off. And I received the Xbox One pad yesterday, and I received the uh, Connect today, and they're both working again. So I now have uh, two Xbox One controllers, which is very, very handy if uh, I have friends come over. And uh, the Xbox One Connect is now working, which is very handy for... Uh, well, I use it now and again on FIFA just for a laugh, even though uh, it doesn't like me. It's, it tells me off because uh, I talk very loud, and it thinks that I'm cursing at it, and it, it tells me off, which... Uh, I don't appreciate too much, but uh, I also use it a lot on Project Spark. Uh, I gave out a load of codes uh, a few weeks back of Project Spark, and it's sort of a game for Xbox One where you you make games. It's sort of a game of a software to make games. Very, very weird, weird setup, but great. I I've been addicted to that for quite a while. Um, I don't use Xbox Connect with the uh, with Forza too much. Um, there's not really much you can do with Forza with it. It's sort of um, there's head tracking, but that's about it, which is quite fun to use now and again. Um, but I, I've just been enjoying enjoying the Xbox One more than using the Kinect capability of it. I just didn't want to have a broken one. I don't use the Kinect too much, but I just didn't want a broken one, as, as most of you can probably understand. But this is coming on. We've now got 
where the floors are going to be and it fill all those in, which is going to be one hell of a job. Um, but that's looking pretty cool. It's at night time, so you can't really see it too well. I do apologise. You will see it in the daytime at some point, I'm sure. <laughs> uh, but we're going to build a crane on the back of that once I fill all this in. So I shall be right back with you guys. I know this is only another two and a half minute clip or something. Um, but I want to show you the progress on what I'm doing. I'll try and fill all these in. God knows how long it's going to take. It's probably going to be the next day before I do the next recording clip. Uh, but I'll fill it in. I'll be right back, guys. <sighs> All right, guys, so I filled one, two, three of the floors in, and I was like, nah, I'll do it later, I'll do it later. It doesn't look bad, it gives you the gist of uh, the idea of what's going on. And I had this little tiny bit on the end there, just for a little bit of shape. There's not much there, maybe that would be the, the entrance or something like that. But, onto the fun bit, I want to build a crane on here. And uh, maybe I would actually build another pillar... On here because I want to mm, I don't know we're gonna build a crane here but what I'm gonna do is bring these these wooden planks out a bit because I think what I'll do in the end is actually extend a concrete pillar up here as well uh, out probably one more something like that and then the pillar would go straight up to there I think that's what I'll do let's do one more just for good luck so then you'd get like um like an L shape on the side of the, the big square but anyway we're gonna put the crane up here and the way we want to do it the crane is going to be three blocks wide one two three one two three one two three one two three it's not going to be like a super super wide one and we've got two colors that we can do it in oops we can either do it in red or in yellow now red is sort of or orange red yellow or orange really i think i'm gonna do yellow just because it's sort of more of a crane cut like more of the default crane color i don't know we'll see what it looks like if we don't like it we can always swap it out um let's go up to about here about there and then we're gonna go out here and drop this back down yeah sort of yellow is a bit more scaffolding i also want to put some scaffolding around certain parts of this construction site as well we'll see how much we can get done today if not we might have to split this up into two episodes we'll continue building it next episode as well but we'll see how we get on i don't know how we get gonna get on yet um but there's actually a lot of stuff i want to put in this construction part of it one two three four five one two three four five oops was that nope up there as you can see i work on the number five a lot in my builds because it's an odd number and it just make thing, it makes things a lot easier to build with. One, two, three, four, five. We'll go to there. There we go. And then we can fill that in on all the other parts as well. We go. If we go inside, we can do inside, can't we? There, there, there. There, there, there. Woo! No! There. There, there, and there. And this will give the sort of craney look. I know it's not the biggest crane in the world. But it's going to do the job. We don't really need a huge, massive crane here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll work fine. That'll work fine. We can always maybe even split it up in the middle. That's why I use an odd number. So if we need to, we can half things. It might be better if it was halved again. But for now, that'll do. For now, that'll do. And now what we're going to do is along, probably starting from about here. I think we're going to build out. Let's get the splash potions going. Okay, so we're going to build this out to about about i don't know stand back have a look yeah about there looks good so that's going to be the top and then the bottom will bring out a few more blocks probably like that will probably be good we'll do the same on this side whoops on this side not that side do the same on this side and this is going to be the crane. Now, um, we also need a counterweight on the other side as well to stop the crane from tipping forward. When we pick the stuff up, they usually have this big, big, big weight on the back. So we'll do something like here, like that, and then make a bit of a platform for it. I don't know, like maybe, uh, 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 uh. Yeah, 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 that'll be good. And then bring this back a few blocks, maybe five, make a nice square. Something like that, but you can always make it bigger. In fact, yeah, I think we need to bring it out another two blocks. Seven, which is still an odd number. There we go. And then we shall put this on the back here. And this will be like our concrete weight on the back. Counterbalance. I'm pretty sure it's called a counterbalance. I'm not 100% sure. 
We'll go up here and we'll do th through two or three. Let's see what two looks like. No, let's try three. We'll do one more layer like this because this crane is going to be lifting some heavy panels, big skyscraper glass panels and stuff like that. I want to do some wood and stuff like that, some big planks about. Okay, so there's that. And we'll probably even do something like that to make it look a little bit more structurally sound. What do you guys think? Like that. That sort of makes a little bit more more realistic. And for along here, I've got some pictures of cranes up on, on the internet at the moment. So I'm sort of going off them a little bit, trying to... Trying to get my mind into it because I don't know my cranes too well. Let's poke a hole there and there. Okay, that look that's looking pretty good. That's looking pretty good. I don't know really what's at the top. The picture's cut off at the top. So I'm going to have to just guess at the top there when it comes to it. Um, one, two, three. Let's do it smaller. So it's going to be every two blocks like that. Uh -huh. Oops. Splash me. We'll get this going. Uh huh. And along here. Oh, it's just, I tell you what, building all those floors, filling all those floors in, was the dullest job I have ever done on this city. Well, uh, apart from the roads, the roads are, are, are incredibly, incredibly boring to do. Okay, but let's do the slidey bit. So we're going to use fence posts here. We're going to go one, two, three. One, two, three for now. Just to see. We go like this. And like this. And then these will also go along the top. And this is the part that's going to slide forward and backwards. Maybe we'll do this bit red. Put a bit of it. Let's get bed as well so we can sleep away the night in a second. And a bit of red wool as well. Get a bit of colour in here. Right. <laughs> Wake up. Right. Red wool. If we done something like... And we have to have these along the bottom. Uh oh, one more. And uh like that. Red wool in here. Now I don't know if this is gonna look any good, but it's I want to just give a bit of an impression of Yeah, that looks okay. That looks okay. I think. I think. I'm not hundred percent sure. Uh what side was that on? Uh -huh. Gaps there. Aha. Uh -huh. Like that. Like that. These sort of they're not meant to be an S shape. I'm just sort of filling them in to give a bit of a just a structurally sound shape. Like that. So that looks like that's gonna be sliding forward and backwards. And now in the middle here, which is another reason why we do an odd number, we can then bring this down. Maybe a bit further. Like this. And now we need a hook on the bottom. And for that. We'll probably use this and we'll go there, 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 there. Does that look like a hook? It sort of looks like a hook, doesn't it? Let's just stand back. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool. I like that on the top of there. Obviously, I would have to structure this up a little bit. We'd have to get these um these big pillars in. One here. How far were we out with the wood? Oops. Oh, we were bang on. Woohoo! Let's just fill this in quickly. This won't take two seconds, guys. Bear with me. Bear with me. Down here. Whoops. Okay. We'll just leave it like that for now. We'll do the other pillars later on. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I might continue the crane down. Actually, I probably won't continue the crane down. Um... But now it's time for a little bit of fun. We're going to do the diggers. We need a porter cabin of obviously where they, they have their cups of teas. We're going to have to have maybe some uh, porter loos would be quite funny. Um, we'll do that in a minute. But I think first we need to work on the machinery, the diggers and stuff like that. So we're going to get some black wool. We're going to get some buttons with some ladders and some rail for the tread. Some yellow wool. Some grey wool, uh, some glass, we're going to need some glass, I'm just trying to go through and collect everything that we might need first. Some fences, okay, that'll do. Now we're going to go 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five. And then these are going to be where our like uh, tracks are going to be, like so. So there's one track. And then we're going to have yellow. In fact, ooh, that sounded like a bang outside. No, seems pretty good. We get a lot of accidents where I live, so I'm always on the on the hair out for for bangs and and smashes. <laughs> uh, someone's there. Dogs are barking. Right there, and we got the black wool. The black wool we're gonna put here, 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 here. Oops, I was looking at the picture and I, I said here and I didn't place anything. Right there, 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 there. there. No, we'll have a glass bit in the back. Yeah, like that. There, there. Uh huh. This is going pretty well. This is going pretty well. It's not looking abnormally shaped yet, which means we're doing something right. Like that. Don't you hate it when it does that? Oh, I hate it when it does that. Right along here. I love doing this. I love just like making up builds as we go. Uh, just get some creativity in here. There we go. Now we're going to have the crane arm like that, like that, like that, something like that. And then fill these in with some fences which we're going to use for to look like the hydraulics. Yeah, yeah. And there. And then we're going to get the bucket on. So the bucket's going to be three wide and there and I apologize for that guys that was a bang in the end <laughs> I was right but there's the digger bucket we did do the digger bucket anyway what if we filled what if we done that would that be a better shape for a bucket it's a huge bucket that's some shoveling that is some shoveling that looks pretty cool though and then I think what we could do to make it a little bit more interesting is maybe get some of this I was using brown wool that's that what that is to the left of us here this is brown wool so if we pile this up around it like this it sort of looks like we're digging into it maybe like this let's just do a little bit like that uh-huh and then here and then Actually, if we take some dirt away, like this. I want to do a bit more terraforming here and take some dirt away. How does that look? And what if we do that? A bit of this action in here. Yeah, like that. Like, that looks pretty good, I think. I don't think that, does, that doesn't look too bad, does it? Yeah, I like that. As a little, Maybe we can do a little bit more to it. Put some... Um, Oh, I wonder. Torches might actually look really good as the emergency lights. You know, the, the round flashing lights on them. That's pretty cool. We obviously need to get into it. If we do want to get into it, we can now get into it like that. And that adds a little bit more detail. Some signposts. Oh, I burped then. I apologise, guys. That was disgusting. <laughs> and there. Have some orange lights like that. Maybe have... um. Like that, like that. Oops, I didn't want to throw it. Give it back. I done it again. I keep pressing the wrong button. How come I forgot? Oh, because of the rail. That's why I can't put it there. Uh, I don't like this back. We need to fill this in. Like that. What's the front like? I forgot about that. Um. What looks better? I think, nope. That definitely looks better. And let's put that there. There we go, that looks better. We'll do this along the back here as well. Get some redstone torches for the rear lights. There we go. And I think that's looking pretty cool. What about some trap doors? You know I love me some trap doors. Um, now where can we put these? We can put one there. That looks pretty cool. Just, just for something. Food for thought. What about there? And there, and what if we put ladders? Oops, if we put ladders on here, I think that looks like um, like pipes and stuff, huh? That doesn't look so bad. 
That looks pretty cool. I like that as a little digger. And uh, let's work on a very, very quick uh, cabin for them to be able to have their cups of tea in. And then we're going to have to call it an episode, guys. I've run well over time here. I'm pretty sure. I'll check the clock in a minute. But I'm pretty sure we've run well, well over time. So we're going to go like this. Um, uh, let's just see what this looks like for size first. I don't know if we want it any bigger. It might need to be a little bit bigger. It might look a little bit too small. What do you think? Yeah, it's way too small. All right, we're going to go out one block. We'll do it like that. And then it'll look like the legs are a bit more supportive. Go out one block around the perimeter wider. And we should have it white at the bottom. I haven't filled the, finished this building yet. There's actually some more stuff that we want to do on this building. But there's so much on the construction site that I want to do that... Um, we are going to have to split this into two episodes. I did think that we would. Because uh, I want this to look really good. I want this to sort of be a, a real integral part of the map. Um, we want some light grey wool, I think. Just to add a little bit of different colour to it. Like so. Maybe you guys can build this along and, I don't know, uh, try and improve it. You guys always send a lot of pictures in to me to my Twitter, which I really, really love. I'd like to thank anybody who sends any pictures in like that. Uh -huh, uh -huh. And then we'll have grey wool again, like this. Oh, we need a door as well. They need to be able to get in it somewhere, don't they? We'll go along here like this. And here, and here. And then fill in the top. And that's their little porter cabin, where they have all their, their cups of teas in the morning. Um, We'll do it there. Boop, boop. Oh, no, wrong one. One colour. Uh, iron door. I'm getting used to, I still haven't got used to where the doors are on here yet. I find them a little bit awkward. And the stairs. I'm not quite used to them being where they are yet. Oops. There. There. What about there and there? I know it's a little bit weird, but I think that's going to be... That's, that looks a little better. Yeah. <laughs> that looks pretty cool, guys. I like that. I like that. All right. Next episode, we shall continue building this. Uh, and, and finish it off hopefully next episode so uh, we shall see you then guys if you enjoyed it hit that like button if you haven't already please subscribe and we shall see you in the next episode bye <laughs>